I'm Lauren Meltzer and you're watching the feed here at Roger Williams University. Last Wednesday, the university held a relief art show to fundraise for Haiti. Well, this is obviously another great example of Roger Williams students and faculty in the community coming together around an important cause, just like we did during Katrina and the tsunami. Uh, this is to benefit the uh, people struck by the tragedy in Haiti. It's also a great way to uh, showcase our students' art. We get some wonderful art and wonderful photography. Now, this supports our twin values of service and uh, having a global perspective. So I'm just so proud that the Roger Williams community um, has gotten together about this really important issue, and I'm just delighted to be here. Event coordinators Johanna and Brett McKenzie collected over 60 pieces of artwork from local artists and students for this fundraiser. I had one class of students with Mari McMillan who did photographs that are behind me and um, and the rest are is all original art from artists all over the state from Massachusetts as well and um, and they all contributed. And what we really want to do is get community artists involved with some of the Roger Williams artists. The artists were phenomenally generous and said, you know, we've heard lots and lots about Haiti. We had that big show on MTV and things like that. And performing artists have been very involved, but very few people have asked visual artists. Plan USA is one of three sponsors chosen for this event, which will deliver earnings from the fundraiser to help develop safer communities for Haiti. All the money is collected at the Plan US office, which is based in Warwick, and then it's sent to our international headquarters based in the UK, and they uh, give it out to our staff on the ground in Haiti. Uh, we've been working in Haiti for over 30 years, and we have 143 staff, 142 of whom are Haitians, so they live in these communities, they're from these communities, they know what the communities need, so they're getting all the money, and it's up to them to decide how it's best spent, um, but typically right now it's being spent on emergency needs. Professor Murray McMillan reflects on the work of his students displayed at the fundraiser. The students got very excited about putting some work and generating some money for it, and so uh, we created a class project out of it, and uh, they, they really delivered with some beautiful work. I love the fact that we're an educational institution and that we're doing something very cultural. Um, so that's been really exciting that we can sell grilled cheese and hot chocolate, but the fact that we, our flagship event has really been an educational and cultural event. To me, that's really important. I'm Lauren Meltzer, and you've been fed.